long ago, when the Invincible Source roamed the Earth, there were two newly born Invincible Sources. There was me, of course, and the other one. His name was Invincible Source the First. You already know a lot about me, but I'll get back to me later. Invincible Source the First. Since he was called, I mean, since that was his name, he thought he was the best out of the Invincible Sources that he started boasting off. Not only that, he started to show off. He always said this. Ha! I think I'm, I mean, I'm always the best Invincible Source around. Ha! Luckily, his arrogance got the better of him. When he saw me talking to some other dinosaurs, and saw how famous I was, boy was he jealous! He was so jealous that he wanted to kill me. On my 13th birthday, Invincible Source the First started his ambush. Little did he know that I was older than him. I knew a lot about being an Invincible Source. He didn't. Because once he started to start the ambush, I was so smart that he that I knew he was there. I turned to him. He knew that, he, that I saw him. What do you think you're doing? I'm trying to kill you, obviously, because you were taking my spot as the most popular uh, invisible source. I'm invisible source the first. I should be. I should be the most popular. Well, it's only because that you're a big bully. I completely roasted him there, but boy was he mad! So mad that he started to charge at me. Little did he know, I knew self-defense. So when he was just about to reach me, <sighs> I tail slapped him, causing him to hit the side of a cliff. Uh, uh, but he wasn't finished yet. But what he didn't realize, when he hit, when he actually hit the, the hill, it started a landslide. <laughs> Rubble crushed him. If it was his own choice, if I didn't self-defense myself, he would have killed me. He was up there for an, for over a month until exterminator arrived. But he wasn't alone. Spinosaurus saw the invisible source the rubble inside his rescue. When he cleared the rubble, Invincible Source the first was completely flattened. He was dead. But luckily, the Spinosaurus had a couple tricks on his sleeve. He restored him, but this time he was even bigger, and was paint and, and his color was now brown. And what was the dinosaur, you may ask? It was Seth! Seth hated me too. He wanted to be dead. He was looking for a sidekick, because Exterminator wasn't actually his kind. Then he thought that Invincible Source the first would be And he said to him, Your name will no longer be Invincible Source the first. Your new name will now be called Chupacabrazilla. Why would you call it Chupacabrazilla, you may ask? Guys, it looks very terrifying! And he was round, just like a true cop. Seth's idea worked. <laughs> Super Copperzilla basically walked around the earth. He was hoping that I would be dead. But he was wrong. When he saw me living for so long, he was completely angry. But. When he saw that I was friends with VF49, he thought that it crossed the line for him. So he sent out multiple monsters out to go get me. Even Seth tried to defeat me, but it didn't work out quite well. And to make matters worse, he was actually the real master, despite being so angry. <gasps> he was so mad that he kept sending in more monsters to defeat me, but it didn't work. He stood on a cliff, looking down on my island, and he promised to himself, Just you wait, Joshua. I will return. <laughs> but 
Did you really think I would let him do that? No, because I am Joshua Zola, Invincible Source the Third, and then we'll stop him one way or another. <laughs>